Hey everyone, we're gonna walk through how to install a PowerPro Micro into one of our Gator Shell boards. Right Today we're gonna to do the Rackham, but this would be the same uh, in terms if you're doing it on a Rover Gator Shell. Obviously that would just be at the back of the, the Rover. So you're gonna pull this apart because you wanna get your mounting plate bracket first. A couple things to keep in mind where it says PowerPro. You want that, uh, so I'm reading it normally, facing backwards. And you'll notice on the board right at the back through hole, right in front of it, you have four uh, pre-plumbed screw holes ready for this application. So I'm just gonna match up the holes. Make sure everything's matched up. And take a screwdriver. So it's important, there's definitely no need for a power drill of any sort in here. Uh, and all you're gonna have to do is just screw these down so that the screws are nice and snug. So. There we go. Just working around, getting all four of them tightened down. Again, not going too tight, just so it's nice and snug. This isn't going anywhere. And then, now it's just a, a matter of putting the pieces together. So you can drop these in either side. You drop your bolt through and screw. Screw this on. Tighten it down. Get a couple more cranks on it. Nice and tight. And then you'll notice right here, this Power Pro Micro is matching up perfectly with the through hole in the board. So what's handy here is if you're out fishing, of course this is key fob base, so you see that big monster red over there, you wanna make a cast, quickly spike the anchor, make the cast, catch the fish, have a great day. So a uh, key piece of equipment for you if you're serious about fishing, you know, this can go on our rovers on either back pontoon, of course it can go on our inflatables, any of the boards that have the Power Pro Micro plate in the back, or in this case on the gator shells built into the board itself.